Hello, young ones. My name is Doris, and you're probably wondering what an old woman like me could possibly have done to be in prison for the next five years. Well, let me explain. It all started with Officer Robert. I was simply speeding because 80 kilometers per hour is far too bloody slow, but he didn't seem to think so. Honestly, I couldn't understand a word he said, so I simply drove off. Officer Robert didn't appreciate this, and I crashed my bike into a stupid pole which appeared out of nowhere. The police surrounded me, but this isn't why I'm here for five years. I'll get to that. I escaped the grand plan. Jumping into my friend's truck, we left at slow speed and failed to get away because she had to answer the phone. Yes, I know. Who the hell answers the phone in a police chase? Robert eventually cuffed me and took me to my first ever prison sentence. Except he lied. So you will be spending time in one of our fine establishments. It's called the DOC Hotel. Oh, lovely. You've got a nice 60 bad. month sentence in. It's like a Hilton. It's, um, yeah, it's like a Hilton. It's got plenty of animals for you to look at as well. Oh, I love animals. Robert told me that prison was a dreamland, a hotel built for women of my stature. It was not. I was mugged on the first day for a single stamp, and since I've been out, I've been living the life of crime. I blame Officer Robert for leading me down this dark path, but also for lying about the DOC and how it was like a hotel. I decided that Officer Robert must pay. So, I bought a machine gun and I bided my time. I'd eventually catch him on his own. That's when I hit an unfortunate man on the highway. Machine gun was stowed safely in the back of my car and Robert was none the wiser. Time to put my plan into action. I took him hostage. I made him drive my off-roader to the top of Mount Chiliad, where I was going to make him say sorry. Robert made a very good point, though, that if he didn't check in soon, people would come looking for him, so I let him tell his fellow officer friends that he was okay. I mean, Doris, I'm going to have to check in on the radio. Yeah. Just to let everybody know that I'm fine. Yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. You can let them know you're fine, won't you? Yeah, that's fine. 22 Lincoln 17, I'm currently code 69 after the last accident on the highway. Sadly, I don't think he told me the truth again. Tut tut, Officer Robert. A helicopter arrived and Officer Robert escaped. I also escaped, or so I thought, and my devious plan of simply taking my clothes off and hiding in a bush did not work. I was caught by a sheriff and taken back to prison, where I'll now be serving a lot of time. Mark my words, Officer Robert, you haven't heard the last of me. XOXO, love Doris. <laughs>